Hello everyone. So today we will see what are the issues while we are doing the MIGO or ML81 N service entry sheet. So usually I will create one order. It is related to plant maintenance and MM. Okay. So I'm creating one order. So I will give as uh, this is test for service entry sheet. Okay. Now in the operations, I'm usually maintaining it as control key three. And you can see some standard errors. So these errors are uh, due to the cost element is not assigned. So we can also do it manually. Just select this line item and go to the external. And here give the uh, short text, nothing but service master. Okay. So here, <clears throat> SES1, give quantity 1, AU, loss price as 10, and give the cost element. So cost element can be chosen as per the controlling area. So usually for which controlling area you are creating this order should be here. So that, that will filter the errors. You can take any controlling area and click enter. Okay, now go back one step. Now try to check the cost. You can see cost was determined, no issues. Now release the order. Now go to the external. You can see the service entry sheet in actual data. So you can see it is in this manner because it is not saved. What code is not saved. Now go to the save button, click the save. Now go to order, change. Now you can see in the operations, 185, okay? Now I will go to ME81N, ME21N to convert this PR into PO. One second, I forgot to copy the PO number. Okay, I just copy the PO number, 185. Now go to ME21N. So this is a PO screen. We can convert the PR into PO. Just scroll down a little bit. And you can see the purchase rec here. So give the PR number here, give enter. Give vendor. So you can see contract exists for the material group. Now Click on the check the document. You can see no message issues during check. Save the document. If you go to this one, you can see the PO number. Okay. Just copy the PO number and go to ML81N. Here, click on the other PO, give the PO number and click enter. No matching PO selected. If you click on the this one, you can see some standard error is there. Okay, these are some common errors you can see. So what, what to do to fix the error? Again, go to ME22N. It is change of PO. Okay, give the PO number again. Go to the change mode. And if you go to the item detail and go to the delivery section, you can see GR is unchecked here. Check this one. Save it. Now again go to ML81N. Give the PO number. Click on the create. Test, demo, whatever I can give. Click on the service selection. Adopt full quantity. Click enter. Now Again, adopt services and confirm the services. Now save it. Now, if you go to work order, you can see the actual cost is generated. It means you have confirmed the operation. If you go to operation and see the actual data, you can see PO exists. So this is how we can execute service PR with maintenance order.
Thank you.